Hi everyone, my name is Engineer Arjun Singh and today I'm going to tell you about the elastic strain energy in an object. So let's begin. Now elastic strain energy or the strain energy is the energy stored by an object when a certain force is applied and which basically leads to the deformation of the object. Now this energy stored is basically under the elastic limit. So this is also termed as a restoring energy. So when the force is removed, the, uh, the, uh, the energy basically tries to uh, regain the position uh, or regain the shape of the object. Uh, for example, if we are, uh, if there is a sp uh, spring system, and I'm going to compress the spring, and at that uh, particular moment, the strain energy is stored in that uh, elastic strain energy is stored in that uh, spring, and when I remove the uh, uh, when I remove the uh, force, then this elastic strain energy tries to uh, regain uh, the shape of the spring or the position of the spring. So this is termed as the elastic strain energy. When we uh, consider the finite element method the uh, potential energy or the whole uh, uh, work done basically is uh, divided into two parts one is the strain energy and the second one is the work potential so we'll be uh, discussing that in the upcoming lecture uh, thank you everyone for watching